Mattel Christian Siriano has designed red carpet looks for hundreds of superstars, ranging from Oprah Winfrey to Celine Dion. But as of today, he's dressing another icon Barbie herself. The New York designer famous for his vision of red carpet inclusivity has created five Barbie-sized looks for the Barbie inclusive body type line that launched last year. And while none of these are for sale, unfortunately, he sees the opportunity to dress Barbie as a way to broaden his dressing Albany type's vision into doll and territory. Barbie has always been a huge inspiration to me, and I'm honored to be teaming up with this iconic brand, Siriano said in a statement. It's especially exciting to be designing an array of inclusive and diverse doll looks that can allow girls to see themselves better represented when they play. Getty Mattel four of the five dolls are inspired by gowns celebrities have worn on the red carpet, including the two-piece white and bitch look Sarah Hyland wore to the 2011 Emmys. The fifth look is inspired by the Resort 2018 collection. It was incredible to recreate iconic red carpet moments and dress my latest muse, Barbie, in a new look from my Resort 2018 collection, Siriano said. Related see the new diverse can dolls Getty Mattel are favorite of the five the off-the-shoulder pretty woman inspired red gown that was originally worn by Leslie Jones to the Los Angeles premiere of Ghostbusters. I knew I wanted to be sexy and show off my body a little bit, Jones told reporters at the premiere of the look. Earlier this year, Siriano told people how important it is to him to dress a variety of shapes and sizes and ages on the red carpet. I don't go after the young, newer girl, he said. They're fabulous, but what's exciting to me is seeing someone different on the carpet looking amazing, like Leslie Jones or Meg Ryan or Danielle Brooks, whom I love so much. Mattel rather, his goal is about celebrating yourself before anything, he said. When we're making clothes, we imagine how women feel if they can't find something that they feel good in. So that's the challenge. I think women are becoming more confident, they're embracing their bodies and celebrating themselves. But there's so much going on in our world politically, and just there's so much craziness that I think fashion should be your one outlet to have fun and play. It's a feel-good thing. It's an escape from the rest of the hate going on. So that's what fashion should be. I think that's what hopefully most women feel like more and more now. Tell us which doll is your favorite let us know in the comments.